Hey everybody, it's Tina Plackinger. Welcome to my channel where I read daily devotions out of my daily devotional called Treading on Serpents. I don't know how the lighting is going to be. But it doesn't matter as long as I get the message out. And today is a short and sweet one. May 23rd. He will keep you if you want him to. TIs are people who have a bold heart. Every day we fight off demons sent from the spirit world, those that jump in and out of the vessels of gang stalking perpetrators. Not everyone is as privileged as us to be able to respond as warriors while safely abiding under God's protection. He will always give us the victory through his gifts of courage and boldness. When we bring our issues to God, we get in covenant with him. So we have no reason to quit or cave in when the enemy turns up the heat. Today's affirmation is, I thank God for helping me to enjoy my life, even a little. TIs are people who have a bold heart. Targeted individuals. Targeted souls. I think I got that from my friend Scott Sapanek. You can go over to his channel. I am the vet.com, spiritualmarine.com, bornagainisrael.com. I have to give him a shout out because if it wasn't for Scott, Sergeant Scott Sapanik, I wouldn't be doing these videos. He was the only one, it's allergy season here in Chicago, the Windy City. He's the only one that was bold enough to relentlessly bug me about getting my face out there and reading my book. A true friend, a true warrior. So we walk away today with courage and boldness because that. Those are the gifts that we are given as targeted souls, targeted individuals. We stay in the fight. We keep our faith. We live one day at a time. And we focus on Jesus. And we try not to get caught up in the little things. If I got caught up in the little things... I wouldn't be doing these videos either. You know, it's the, the, the chair squeaks. Well, it does usually. I don't hear it now, but um, I feel like Edith Ann in this chair from Rowan and Martin's Laughing. The lighting is never right. My hair is never right. I never have the right clothes. All that stuff. The bottom line is, I've got to do this for the Lord to bring courage, to bring some enlightenment to you. Um, encouragement, to bring encouragement through God's courage and his messages. Thank you for joining me and putting up with my imperfections. Together we can do this thing. I'll see you soon.